Hey everybody, Carl here from Apt, and in this video we're going to show you how to do the easy setup on the new Samsung Q series smart TVs. So the first thing you're going to want to do is download the Smart Things app, and there are two of them out there. So there's one that has just a circle on it. You don't want to do that one. It's not going to work with these TVs. You want to download the Smart Things app that looks like this. It's kind of like a little molecule. So make sure you download that one. And then once you have your TV turned on, it's actually going to tell you to download that app. So you already have it handy. And all you do is click on the app. And right here on this home screen, you're gonna see an option to add a device. So if you click on that, it's going to search for all the available televisions that are designed for this application. Now, we have a lot of Samsung TVs set up here in the store. So this video, we're using the Q7. So for our purposes, we're gonna click on Q7 here. And then it's gonna tell us that it's gonna take some time for your, for your phone to connect to your TV. So we'll give that a second. And from here, it's telling you to enter the pin shown on your TV. So your TV is going to show you a unique pin number and you press on this little line down here at the bottom and we're going to enter that in. So 0081080808 and then click done. And now this is going to register to an email account here. So you want to make sure you have an email account that you can use to work with your Samsung network. And then from here, we're going to select a Wi-Fi network. So we'll click on that and click on one of our available wireless systems here. And then we're gonna agree to all and click on OK. And then from here, it's gonna use a, an email account to register to Samsung again. I mentioned that before. So here's the, here, here's the step where you're gonna agree to that. Um, you're going to have to select the appropriate email address for your own purposes. And now we're going to name the TV. So here you're just going to click on the line and we'll just rename this one apt TV Q7. And then click on next. And then here's gonna be the step where you can connect your devices. We don't have any devices to hook up to this one, but you can see here it's got the One Connect plug-in. Uh, I believe this is for the antenna to plug in. Uh, but again, we don't have anything hooked up other than the One Connect box for this video. So we'll click on Next. And then it's gonna to go to your location. So for here, you just enter your zip code, ours 60025. And then you click on the check mark and hit Next. So that's just giving the TV information based on your zip code. And then here is the next step. You can add, so Samsung has some recommended apps to add like Facebook Video, NBA TV, Spotify. Uh, so you can click on any of those and that's gonna add it to your, to your kind of your smart bar on the television. Uh, so for this one, we'll choose Deezer and Pandora and then click on next. And then that's it. So that's as easy as it gets. And now your TV is gonna be set up from there. So here you can swipe your finger across the screen and it's gonna go across the bottom. Scroll through all your apps that you have pre-done on there. And then here you can go into the ambient mode and kind of change up the backgrounds and stuff on that. So that's how you set up the TV. It's a super simple process. As you can see here, it doesn't take very long and it's really straightforward. So that's how you get everything set up with the, uh, with the easy setup on the new Samsung Q-Series LED TVs. Thank you guys for watching and make sure you subscribe so you get uh, updates every time we put up new content.